Hey everyone, welcome back again to another Tech Guru video. Today I'm bringing you the best Google tricks, tips, hacks, and Easter eggs through Google search. So Google has all kind of neat things that they put uh, within their search results that allows you to uh, search for different word phrases that allows you to pull up some really neat stuff. So I'm going to show you the top 20 that I've found throughout the web. So let's go ahead and get started. The first one is Google Gravity. So all you'll need to do is type in Google Gravity, okay, and then go to I'm feeling lucky. Click on that, and then when you click on the box here, the whole thing falls down. And that is Google Gravity. Just type in Google Gravity and click on I'm feeling lucky. The next one I have is do a barrel roll. So if you just start typing in do a Bar boom, there it goes. The whole page will just do a barrel roll. You don't even have to finish it, okay? So if you just start clicking and you start typing in do a barrel roll, the whole screen will do a circular barrel roll. The next one is Google Pac-Man game. This one is really neat. Not a lot of people know about this. If you type in Google Pac-Man game, just like that right there, the first link is Pac-Man Google. Click on that and your Google image up top then becomes your own Pac-Man game. You can click on it and you can now play Pac-Man within your Google search results. So now I am actually controlling the Pac-Man up there and I can actually play a whole Pac-Man game within my Google search results box. So I'm going to go ahead and go back now and I will have a list of these in the description box below as well. The next one is Epic Google. Type in Epic, okay let me spell it right, Epic Google and then go to I'm feeling lucky and once you do that you'll notice it'll have a epic Google logo and the search bar and the text will continuously get bigger and bigger and bigger and you can search for stuff so let's say I'm searching for an iPhone you can say I'm feeling excessive and then once you're here it'll take you to the search results uh, and then you can do an epic search as well and all of the text will be bigger than normal so the next one that I'm going to be showing you is going to be Google Hacker have you ever wondered what it would be like if Google was hacked? Well, this right here will show you. Type in Google Hacker. Well, not really show you what it would be, but if you type in Google Hacker, you'll see all these weird numbers up here. You'll see some stuff up here under the search results. And then when you type in, so if I'm searching for iPhone, I misspelled it there. If I'm searching for iPhone, over here on the left, you'll see all of these weird numbers and letters and stuff. And that is done by typing in Google Hacker and then clicking on I'm feeling lucky. The next one that I will be showing you is annoying Google, and this one is indeed annoying. So type in annoying Google and then go to I'm feeling lucky. Click on that right there. And then once you're there, you'll see an uh, annoying Google text here. And let's say I'm searching for an iPad. I will type in iPad and as you see there, anything that I'm typing in, my letters are being capitalized, they're being lowercased, and they're, Google is doing this, and it is very, very annoying. And in order to get here, you just need to type in annoying Google, and then click on I'm feeling lucky. The next one that I'm going to be showing you is Google uh, it, backwards. It's the mirror effect. Type in E. L-G-O-O-G, -O -O -G, which is Google spelled backwards, and then go to I'm feeling lucky. Once you're there, everything, as you can see, has been mirrored, and it is now backwards. So now when I type in uh, a search here and then go to search for it, uh, everything will be backwards, okay? So as you can see here, the whole home page, Google search, I'm feeling lucky, every bit of the text on this page is now indeed backwards, and that's done by typing in E L G. O O G, and that is again Google backwards. The next one is Google Sphere. Okay, so type in Google S P H E R E, and then go to I'm feeling lucky. Once you've done that right there, this really neat uh, visual effect comes up, and all of the text begins to orb orbit or whatever you call it, it, it begins to rotate around the Google uh, logo there and that's really neat and you accomplish this again by typing in Google Sphere and then clicking on I'm feeling lucky. The next one I'm going to is Google Loco so type in Google L-O-C-O -O, and then click on I'm feeling lucky. Once you do that, you will be presented with this Google Loco page here. And when you begin typing in stuff, so let's say I'm searching for basketball, you see there the color changes, the color of the text changes, and it's just a crazy fun uh, 
thing to do there. So if you want to accomplish that, just type in Google Loco and then click on the I'm Feeling Lucky link. Uh, the next one that I want to show you is a really neat one. Uh, type in LOL LimeWire, L-I-M-E-W-I-R-E, and then click on I'm Feeling Lucky. And then it'll take you to this right here. It'll say do what you want. And let me turn the... And as you see there, you got some pirates dancing around. You've got the the background changing colors, and uh, it pretty much is just a neat little video, little visual there. So you accomplish that again by typing in LOL LimeWire and then clicking on I'm Feeling Lucky. The next one is Rainbow Google. Type in R-A-I-N-B-O-W Google and then click on the I'm Feeling Lucky link. And once you do that, you've got a nice Rainbow Google homepage here. And all of the uh, text up here is now in uh, rainbow colors. And uh, you can accomplish that again by typing in Rainbow Rainbow Google and then clicking on I'm feeling lucky. The next one is Google Magic. Type in Google Magic and click on I'm feeling lucky. When you do that, stay on the page for a few seconds and as you will see up here, the O's on the Google logo up here will begin to disappear. If you type it there, there they go right there. So this again can be accomplished by typing in Google Magic and clicking on I'm Feeling Lucky. You can really trick some of your nieces and nephews if they're uh, at the age to where they still believe in magic and you can touch the screen and pretend like you are making those O's go away yourself. So again, type in Google Magic, I'm Feeling Lucky. The next one is Google Color. You can change it to whatever you want. So say Google uh, Orange here, okay, and then click on I'm Feeling Lucky and you will be uh, redirected to a orange search. And you can do that with primarily any color you want. So say you want to do Google Blue. So type in Google Blue and then go to I'm Feeling Lucky and you will be displayed with a blue Google search page here. So you can do that with a lot of different colors. Just play around with that and type in Google plus whatever color you want to see. The next one is Epic Box. Okay, so type in E-P-I-C Box and then go to I'm Feeling Lucky. When you do that, you will be presented with a video of a little box running around in the desert and uh, this is just a video that uh, someone has created and when you type in epic box and click on I'm feeling lucky you will be presented with that video uh, next you will have weenie Google so type in w e e n i e g o o g l e and go ahead and click on I'm feeling lucky and when you're there you will see the search box and weenie Google will now minimize itself until it's almost uh, you cannot see it so that is uh, a accomplished by typing in W-E-E-N, i.e. Google, and clicking on I'm Feeling Lucky. Uh, the next one I want to show you is Chuck Norris. If you type in Chuck Norris, this one's pretty funny, and then go to I'm Feeling Lucky, it will redirect you automatically to the official site of Chuck Norris, and who does not want to see that? So uh, the next one I'm going to show you will be Gothic Google. If you type in G-O-T-H-I-C-G-O-O-G-L-E, and then click on I'm Feeling Lucky, you will then be presented with with the dark version of Google and it is goth engine and you'll see some flames up top and that's accomplished by gothic Google and the last one that I'll be showing you is Google Pirate all you'll need to do is go to Google and type in Google Pirate and then go to I'm feeling lucky and then once you're there you'll see you are now in the pirate version of Google so you see up here it says engravings cruise so if you search for something say you're searching for basketball and then go to Google search over here you'll see engravings videos shopping more uh, you know everything is in pirate talk uh, and that is from Google so guys this has been uh, my top 20 Google Google tips, tricks, hacks, Easter eggs, whatever you want to call them. Uh, go try them out. If you know some that I have not included in this video, put them in the comment box below. I'll be more than happy to add those. So guys, again, as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my videos. And again, thank you so much for watching my videos, and I will see you guys next time.